do you feel right now? Um, what is the primary emotion? Um, I'm a, I'm a bit disappointed. Um, you know, I, I wanted to go further, but I mean, I, I I played pretty well. Maybe I could have played a little bit better, but I just got outplayed today. Um, I don't care what round you lose in; it's it's disappointing unless you win the tournament, just a little bit. So, but it was it was a good tournament, and I can I can build on this uh, for the rest of the year. Yeah, it's 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 rough. He returns really well and um, makes a lot of balls. And on his serve, you know that's his game. He, he you know he serves about 75% first serves, and he's lefty on top of that, and he's running around and hitting forehand, so he's kind of hard to get in. Um, maybe I could have done it a little bit better um, today, but he for the most part just had me on the run, and you know, I didn't really stand it. Yeah, it is. It's real frustrating. Um, you know, maybe I could have taken some chances, you know, on balls that were somewhat neutral or maybe not that offensive on his part, maybe to try to turn the tide of the point. Um, but I didn't. Uh, but like I said, I mean, when he makes that many first serves, it's it's tough. Even when I get the ball back and play, he's, he's running around the forehand and probably is one of the best forehands in the game, slapping it. So. From the time you had mile uh, started, from the time you got it, how long did it take you felt physically 100% or do you still? Uh, probably about, um, I felt, I mean, after about a month, I felt like it was out of my system, but then I I had to, uh, you know, get my stamina back up, so that took about another month. So, you know, maybe it was a month and a half, maybe, so it was almost like a three-month process. Did you lose a lot of weight? I actually did not lose that much weight. I, my, I never lost my appetite. And yeah, it's not like I had tapeworm or anything. I just <laughs> I had, I ate, and if anything, I might have put on weight. So. Were there any residual effects, physical or mental, after the Roddick match? Um, I, back? I really don't think so. I um, physically, I felt pretty good out there. I did, you know, took care of myself after that match. Um, no, I, I I really don't. I don't. I don't think so. I really just. I think I got outplayed today. That's that's all I can chalk it up to. When you got into a baseline rally with him, did you have a lack of confidence that you could win the point? No, I I, I did. Um, I wasn't winning most of them, uh, but uh, it's tough because he's just he's so quick and he's running around that backhand and hitting that forehand and dictating play. So I mean he he was. He was hitting the the first offensive ball before I was, and then had me on the run. I mean, I was, you know, still felt like I could hang in there. I uh, wasn't completely just lacking confidence there, but it, you know, I just didn't happen, didn't win too many. What, what do you need to do from here to get to the next step, next level? Excuse me. Yeah, just keep doing the same thing I'm doing. Really, um, I know I'm going the right direction. I finally have the right coach in my corner and the and the right people um, that I that I train with in, at Saddlebrook. Um, keep that up, um, you know, not, not be satisfied. And I have a chance to, I didn't really play much in the fall last year, so I can improve my ranking, you know, significantly um, this fall. My goal was to get all seated in Australia, um, Australian Open. Um, so that's, uh, that's important. I think I have six tournaments on my schedule the rest of the year. So, uh, Zero points to defend? Or? Uh, no, just... I guess from where I'm ranked, uh, not that many points at all. Only like 80 or something like that. I, I'm not exactly sure. What sort of statement do you feel the U.S. men made in the uh, in the Open here? Uh, well, I, we got a lot of people to the round of 32. Um, then obviously I played Andy, and so that assured that one was going to move move on and one was going to stay back. And but after that, kind of. Um, didn't do so well, but I mean it was tough draws. I mean Sam lost to Soderling and Taylor lost to Andy Murray and I, I can't remember who else. And you know maybe James had a had a really winnable match. He he didn't pull it out, but I mean we did well getting 
we had a handful of people in the round of 32. And it's just unfortunate we couldn't get that many past that. Looking the heads of No, I knew that. I didn't really, I didn't really care. Um, I wanted to keep it going. Uh, no, I didn't really expect. If you would have told me I was the last American, if I, you know, only one American make the final 16, I probably would have thought maybe one or two more would have. But, um, yeah, I knew that. But I didn't really, didn't take too, think too much of it.